John chapter 13 verses 31 to 35. Love one another, love one another, even as I have loved you. Esther Kim knows what this means. For 13 years she had one dream. The Summer Olympics. She wanted to represent the United States on the Olympic Taekwondo squad. From the age of 8, she spent every available hour in training. In fact, it was in training that she met and made her best friend, K. Po. The two worked so hard and for so long that no one was surprised that they both qualified for the 2000 Olympic trials in Colorado Springs. Everyone, however, was surprised when they were placed in the same division. They'd never competed against each other, but when the number of divisions was reduced, they found their names on the same bracket. It would be just a matter of events before they found themselves on the same mat. One would win and one would lose. Only one could go to Australia. As if the moment needed more drama, two facts put Esther Kim in a heart-rendering position. First, her friend Kay injured her leg in the match prior to theirs. Kay could scarcely walk, much less compete. Because of the injury Esther could defeat her friend with hardly any effort. But then there was a second truth. Esther knew that Kay was a better fighter. If she took advantage of her crippled friend, the better athlete would stay home. So what did she do? Esther stepped onto the floor and bowed to her friend and opponent. Both knew the meaning of that gesture. Esther forfeited her place. She considered the cause, an Olympic victory, and her love for her friend, more important than the credit for the victory. This is a good time for a few poignant questions. What's more important to you? That the work be done or that you be seen? When a brother or sister is honored, are you joyful or jealous? Do you consider others more important than yourself? Do you have the attitude of Jesus? Love one another, even as I have loved you. Are you willing to serve or are you only willing to be served? The end result of this self-sacrifice, was that K. Po was highly favored to win, and she made it all the way to the finals but lost. Two years later she would win a silver medal. Was it worth it? Sure it was. Esther Kim showed the whole world what true humility and self-giving meant. The truth is, Po and Kim became international celebrities after Kim forfeited their match so that Po, the more gifted athlete, could realize her lifelong Olympic dream.